I don't know that I've ever figured out why you guys can hear the music, but I can't hear the music. Now it starts. I don't get it. Welcome everybody to Low Bias Monthly for uh, February 2021. I'm your host, the man with a plan. I'm also going to turn that down about two decibels. There's what? There's two. Okay. So, uh, yeah, we're doing, um, video games. Maybe, maybe you picked up on that. Uh, we have our topic is 1980s arcade games. This is a topic from good friend Ragnats. And, uh, I was already all excited to go. And then I remembered how horrible horrible it is to try and emulate arcade games um, especially older ones because not everybody uses the same system you know there's there's like a Capcom system and they have two different versions there's the regular MAME stuff uh, SNK has their own kind of thing it's just a pain to do so uh, we're gonna be playing an arcade game that came out in the 80s and we're gonna be playing a home port of said arcade game that came out in the 80s. Uh, the home port also came out in the 80s, so. We're gonna be playing some Defender. It's a game I had when I was a kid and I really liked, so. Let's uh, turn off Starman there. Turn on Defender. Turn off that music. There we go. Now, uh, this being an Atari 2600 game, there's not really any music to speak of. I think Jungle Hunt had music, and I can't think of any other games that really had music. Pole position, maybe? Bump and jump? One of those. Anyway, um, we're going to be lulled into a false sense of security uh, with the uh, tunes of our good friend Niflis. Uh, the uh, Within a Deep Forest um, it stories Beller. I've got a bunch of his songs queued up and we're just going to hit play. I think that should work. So. Oh, I gotta use the stick. That's terrible. So, the idea in Defender to immediately die from an invisible thing. Um, we have to defend. The chess piece looking dudes. Wow, I'm doing terrible. That guy. He wants to steal the people. And the people are the little flashy dots uh, at the bottom in, this, in the buildings. And we don't want him to, to do that. So we gotta stop him from doing that. So we have a radar at the top of the screen, and if you catch the people, uh, you get bonus bonus points. Pretty cool. This is a little difficult to aim. Really? Fine, we'll do it again. This way this time. Screw that guy. This is probably one of the more played 2600 games I had when I was a kid. Um, some of the other more played games would have included Miss Pac Man, which I thought was very good. Um, played Jungle Hunt a lot, played Adventure a lot. Go. Stage one complete. I don't know how long we're doing this. We're, we're not gonna go a whole hour of just Defender. Uh, I wouldn't do that to you. No, oh, you don't. Gotcha. <laughs> I want to say combat. I played a lot. I had a blackjack game that I played, but back before I knew how to play blackjack. 
Atari basketball wasn't too terrible. Uh, missile command, of course. I, I guess I died. I had a game called Warlords, which was kind of like a weird full contact breakout. like a submarine game and an airplane game. You know, kind of at that point where a lot of them were just the same game, just the the thing that you, the dot that you were supposed to be and or kill was a little different. I remember combat being pretty fun. Actually, I've got a little uh, handheld 2600 that I got for Christmas a couple years back and Got some good stuff on it. It's got adventure. Some games we never played, like Ah, like Yar's Revenge and stuff like that. This game on that is very hard because the screen is very small. Used to be way better at this. It's probably been 28 years since I last played Defender. So I'm going to blame my ineptitude on just uh, being out of practice. Donut got me, I guess. I don't know. I remember the box art for this was really good. I'm gonna use that in the thumbnail. Probably has a better ending than Erigez, I would I would say. I feel like this may have been a big inspiration for um, ActRaiser, a little bit. The simulation segments of ActRaiser. Think about it, but not too hard. Sorry, buddy. You'll be fine. Being that um, this is not a topic that's going to take a long time, um, we're not going to be streaming every week. I don't think, at least not this. Oh, that guy spawned on top of me. It's no fair. So, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if we'll do something else or not. We'll see. I've got stuff I could play that might be fun to, to watch, but it's also kind of yeah, damn it. it's also kind of busy work for one of the let's plays I'm doing, and it's right at the end of the game, and so I don't want to like spoil anything. You know what I mean? So I don't know. I'm going to ignore those guys for a minute. Oh, really? No. <laughs> ah, he got me. That's a jerk. That's a jerk. Okay, tapping the button. 
makes your shot not go across the screen. Just tapping it and letting it go makes your shot go all the way across the screen. I don't remember if it was like that in the original or not. music and videos and podcasts before. Dang, nabbit! Clear the stage, but... But at what cost? Space Invaders? I'm pretty sure we had Space Invaders. I remember we had like a handheld Space Invaders that ran on a... It was just like an LCD screen. Or not LCD. Yeah, LCD screen. And, um, you know, one color. It was red. You could have whatever color you wanted as long as it was red. And it was a, a big monster of a thing. Um, ran on four double A's. And, um, had a two-digit display for your score. And I remember one day when I was a kid, just like, I want to see what happens when I get to 100. I'm going to see. And I sunk a ton of time. Way more than is even, you know, like, I don't want to think about it, because it, it would depress me. Ah, I got me. But I did, and it just went back to zero zero, and I was upset. It's like what? Because every space invader was worth one point, so you had to kill a hundred of them. And the the screen was so small. Not sure why I died. The screen was so small that I think it only fit ten of the things, maybe? So you had to play 10 games to get to 100 points. No no one-ups, no lives, you know. You just, you just played until you died or got bored. And I mean physically died, not in the game died. I liked it. I liked it enough. It was, it was a neat little thing. We had a one of those arcade cabinet looking things for uh, Donkey Kong. I want to say it took C batteries. That was a beast. Ow. Oh. I wish I still had a lot of that stuff, to say the truth. Just, you know, conversation piece, if nothing else. When somebody that knows something about old games comes over and they're like, Wait, that's Earthbound? You have Earthbound? Oh my god! Wait, somebody was over... Hang on. I don't like them. Um, my buddy Matt, who I used to do a podcast with, was over one day at my old house. And he saw it on the shelf and he, he like, made me take a picture of him holding the cartridge. a little silly. Alright. Stage three's over, man. The star guy. Okay, whoop.
Dang damn it. You're doing half so bad for a minute there. I got you. You know what other game had you saving people like that? Um, Zombie Nation. Why are there two sometimes? Ugh. Ow. Little stuff. Let's try game two. I don't know what the difference is. Ow. Whoever was shooting at me, I think they were dead. I think they were, they were long gone. I was gonna see how well I could do just, just by going. Not very, apparently. There you go. Where you at? I don't know what happened there. I forgot how flickery of a game this was. Hopefully it's not too horrible to watch. Go away! Go away, four things! Now how did I shoot the guy behind the guy, but not the guy? I don't get it. No buildings this time, huh? Just the uh, red guys. Just the red guys. Hooray, we did it. Good job, us. Right, ladies and gentlemen. Maybe. Why, why, why? I want to know why I died. No time. Somebody who knows more about Defender than me, tell me why I died. I just know the big lasers are really cool. Yeah, I moved down because I knew you guys were down there and then you moved up. Bunch of jerks. Beautiful. Oh, they are faster. Need a turbo button. Why are you doing up his ups and downs? Blam! 
Yeah. I'm champion. I'm master. You don't know. You thought you knew defender? You didn't know defender. I don't even know defender. Leave me alone. You're red and looks like you have feet, and I don't like it. Ow. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, hey. Don't do that. Saw that one coming from a mile away. I, I didn't see that one coming, that's why I crashed into it. Enough points for a one up, man. Phone, I can't deal with you right now. I'm defending. Fiddlesticks. Fiddlesticks. That's not what I want. How do I undo that? Oh my god. Why does right go down? Help. Help. Did a thing and I'm upset. Let's try game 10. For no reason other than it's two digits. Beautiful. You guys tell the difference? Maybe they just shoot faster. I see. Ow. Oh, I thought I died. I didn't die. Good job. Wow. I believe that worked. those guys. It's hard to hit. Alright, stage two. Stage two in about five more minutes of this, then we're done. And I can take a month from this off. It's it's not as easy as you might think picking picking games for this monthly thing because you want to pick games that are interesting. Uh, topics that are interesting if you're picking a topic and clearly clearly this one could go one of two ways um, but you don't know, like I don't want games that are gonna take like 80 hours to get through because we're gonna have a new topic the month after you know what I mean I want to be able to get it done in four weeks Four to six hours is is good, I think. And like, like this is this is great, but it's really short. You put down that human being, alien man. I don't know. Like I said, next week maybe we'll stream something else. I know we'll get the half hour in for this one and then that'll be it for the night. Because there's no sense in doing this for an hour. What are you going to see that you ain't already seen? You're going to see the one dot and it's going to do things a dot do. And then it's going to shoot other dots and then everybody's going to have a bad time. Oh. Try to avoid it. 
That guy spawned on top of me again, didn't he? I need to stop doing that, clearly. But I don't know what else to do, man. Stop it. Another, where is he? Oh, that was all of them. Okay, never mind. I don't know. I don't know why it happens. I don't know why that happens. I don't know what button I'm pushing to make that happen. Did it again. Dag never. Let's do game mode 18. For no reason other than the number 18. Right off the bat. That guy kills me. Whoa, very fast. See how fast that guy was? He was like space fast. Yeah, I don't know. Dang, damn it. No, I was wrong. Why did doing it twice do it once? Okay, I'll tell you what. Five minutes. Not that. That's horrible. How about this one? Yeah. The hit sequel, Defender 2. It's uh, different. That was that was a thing. Was that a good thing I did? Have I been rewarded for my, my good behavior? I think I want to touch that. I, I died. Something happened? I don't understand. Well, that was a game over right there. That was... Holy crap! You move a little different in Defender 2. And the, the aliens have learned how to shoot. I just killed that guy? I think I accidentally killed that guy. I'm sorry, that guy. Hooray! We did it! Was well, some sort of rocket butterfly. Genius, bad man. Well, there's Defender 2, ladies and gentlemen. Um, that's it for the week. That's also it for the monthly. Um, I'm going to get the podcast done early for once in a long time. It's going to be nice. And then I'm just going to get back to working on some of the crap I should be working on. Um, I want to thank you all for joining. Who, uh, who decided to show up. I want to thank everybody who watched after the fact and um, just point you in the right way. Uh, visit lowbiasgaming.net for more stuff like this where you can see all the previous Low Bias Monthlies and a, literally hundreds of other Let's Plays and soundtracks uh, for video games, movies, game manuals and strategy guides, all that stuff. Uh, links in the description for my Twitter. If you're on YouTube, check out Jason's Groove Machine on Twitch. If you're on Twitch, Jason's Groove Machine on YouTube. There you go. What else do you want? What do you want from me? I don't know what to give you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna 